Tonight, Michigan is at the center of new concerns about the spread of bird flu as the second state to report a human case. A worker at a dairy farm in an undisclosed county was infected and has since recovered. The news comes two months after the first reported outbreak of bird flu among dairy cows, and it fuels concerns about the disease spreading between species. 7 News Detroit reporter Brett Cast is digging into what this could mean for public health. Well, according to the CDC and several other health officials, the risk to the general public right now is still very low, but they're still taking it very seriously to prevent further spread. For the first time ever in Michigan, a human has been infected with bird flu, the second case in the U.S. this year. But the risk to human health still is very low. John Brownstein is an epidemiologist and says right now outbreaks are coming from animals. There is no human human transmission, which is very important reassurance that this problem is still mostly confined to livestock. But this case is just the third human case ever in the U.S. and the second that spread from cows. It's finding avian influenza in dairy cattle is something that, as a virologist, I didn't expect. Kim Dodd is director of Michigan State University's Veterinary Diagnostics Lab, the official animal health lab in the state of Michigan. They've been working around the clock, testing hundreds of thousands of samples per week in the midst of an outbreak among dairy farms. And the reason it was found is that we were hearing reports of dairy cattle suffering from a drop in milk production, sort of a brief fever, slight illness, drop in milk production that was of concern. The outbreak began in Michigan just months ago, with dairy farms now being monitored with testing. In Michigan, it has hit us pretty hard. Phil Durst is also with Michigan State and works with cattle and dairy farms. He says the virus has not been found in beef, and while it is found in milk, pasteurization kills the virus. We, don't, we believe the consumer is totally safe in all this. Right? Our concern, therefore, is for the workers on farms. The case in Michigan was discovered in a farm worker who worked with infected cows. The worker had mild symptoms and has since recovered. The CDC is now recommending caution around dairy cows, urging workers to use PPE, hoping to prevent more human cases and cases among other animals. The longer it continues to replicate in multiple animals, the more likely it is to develop mutations that could make the virus better at spreading across different animal species. And again, to reiterate, health officials are urging the general public not to drink raw milk, to drink pasteurized instead, and avoid unnecessary trips to dairy farms such as field trips and tours. I'm Brett Cast, 7 News, Detroit. Okay, Brett, thank you for that update.